Hello everyone, it's Miros. And if you are using Apple device and you want to receive every update first, I mean first before everyone, even before the people participating in public beta program, this video is for you. Let me show you. Okay guys, this is my iPhone 13 and today I will show you how you can join Apple developer program. And this means you will start receiving every update, developer update first before beta updates are developer updates. Developer updates are not stable of course, they are pre-beta release, so you will receive every update first before everyone else. Let me show you, now I am not using a beta program, let's go in general, software update, and you can see I have only iOS 16.2 and I am up to date. There is iOS 16.3 which is beta 1 for developers in Apple program. So today we will receive that update and every update for developer program which is for macOS, watchOS, iPadOS and iOS. Ok guys, now I will show you something interesting. Let's open the browser and you can see if you want to join Apple beta program, what happened. Complete your purchase, $99 per one year. This is what Apple want from you if you want to be a developer and receive those updates first before everyone else. $99 per one year. That's it. But today of course we will not pay that price. I will show you how you can make that easily and free. First and most important to start you need to use a Safari browser. not. Chrome or something else, you need to use Safari browser. Let's open it. Write Apple Developer Beta Profile in the search bar, scroll down and open that website. Betaprofiles.dev Of course, links will be in video description, so always check first there. And you can see what we have here, Beta Profiles. Scroll down, they have Beta Profiles for iOS, for watchOS, tvOS and so on and so on. So every Apple device what we have here choose a beta developer or public. That's what I'm talking about. Let's check about the public. Below are the public profiles. These profiles are usually released later than developer beta. So it will be stable and less buggy. If you never signed up for Apple's public beta software program before sign up first at betaapple.com so you need to sign first there and here are the beta profiles public beta profiles but we will need a developer one which guys again this will be a buggy update probably with some issues so prepare yourself for that what's written here below are developer profiles it was released first then public beta Therefore, it will also have more bugs. People usually prefer to install a developer beta profile because it's released first. But if you don't want to risk a lot, install the public beta profile. So guys, expect bugs here. But if you are a nerd like me and you want the latest and greatest from Apple to try it now, immediately when they release it, that's it. So, scroll down, iOS, I will speak today for my iPhone, this process is for iPhones, but it will be the same process for your iPad, watchOS and so on. So, get beta updates on your iPhone automatically, install profile, just up here, install profile. Are you sure of this? By downloading and installing this profile, you are enrolled in Apple's developer beta program. The iOS 16 developer beta is still in development, which means some applications and services may not work as expected and their data may not be backwards compatible. Be sure to back up your iOS device with iTunes before installing the software. So, make a backup of everything and just hit install. This website is trying to download a configuration profile. Do you want to allow this? Yes, we want. Profile download. Review the profile in settings app if you want to install it. All right. We are already here. So now we need to go in settings. You can see on the main page what's written profile downloaded. Just hit on it and hit install. 
iOS 16 beta software profile. If you tap here on more details, you can read everything. I will just hit install and let my device to install that profile. Enter your passcode of course. Read everything here carefully and hit install. Restart is required. Please restart your iPhone to apply changes. Restart it. Alright, it's restarted. Let's unlock it. Let's wait it a minute just to refresh everything, to connect with my Wi-Fi and so on. And we are ready. Now let's go in settings. You can check your installed profiles by going to settings, general, and here VPN and device management. Here what's written iOS 16 beta software profile. So it's already installed. Let's go back. And check for software updates. And what we have here, iOS 16.3 developer beta. That's it guys, we are now developers for Apple and we can use latest and greatest. Update requested, now it will start downloading and installing that developer beta update. And of course I will start receiving every developer update before everyone and I can test all the new goodies coming from Apple. And of course guys, if you want to opt out from this developer beta, just remove your installed profile and when release candidate version or public version of iOS 16.3 is out, you will just become a regular Apple user. And that's it, you will be no more developer for Apple. But this is the way to do this without paying and you will start receiving every new update immediately. Thanks for watching and have a nice day.